Hi artists, in this video we're going to look at making a bowl with leaves. So the materials you're going to need for this activity are glue, some fresh leaves that you've picked, and a balloon. And I'm resting my balloon in a bowl to try to keep it still. And if you have tape, it might be a good idea to put a few pieces of tape that are holding that balloon in place just to try to make it as stable of a surface as possible like that so that'll hold it in a few places just so it doesn't wobble on me one thing you do want to do with those leaves as you're working is if they have a little stem on them pinch them off reason for that is that those little pieces are gonna try to are gonna get in the way of what we're making so as we're going we're gonna try to pinch those off as we go so other thing we'll need is some type of brush I'm using a foam brush because that's something that I have um, you could use any other type of material that you have to try to spread that glue but what we're going to do first is put glue on our balloon. If you don't have a balloon, that's okay. An alternative that you could use if you don't have a balloon is you could take a bowl and you could put some plastic wrap over it or plastic bag over the bowl and that would give you a similar surface. The reason I'm using the bolt, this balloon is one because I have a balloon handy. The other reason is that then once this is dried, I can pop the balloon and my surface that I was creating this on, this round surface is gone. So don't have to worry about trying to pry it off of the bowl. My round surface is just disappears when my balloon is popped later but I've got to make sure that the that the glue is totally dry before I do that so after you make it I'd wait a couple of days even patience is hard but it pays off in the end so so I've got that kinda of all the way around and then what I'm going to start to do is put my leaves on here Oop, pinch that off and I'm trying to spread mine out some right now I'm going to be overlapping these meaning that we're going to add more on top of them and they're going to stick up a little bit like you see them doing and that's okay too so what I'm gonna do after I put these first few leaves on is I'm gonna put some glue on top of them and the reason I'm doing that is one to get both sides of my leaves covered the other reason is that I'm gonna put other leaves on top of these and we want the leaves to stick together that's what's gonna make this a bowl is overlapping the leaves and making them kind of stick together so you could do this where you put one leaf and then you put glue on top of it or you could do like I've done here and you put a few on and then put glue on the other side you decide which way will work better with you but the idea is that you're getting glue on both sides of 
your leaves. And we're going to keep doing this until all the leaves are on there. We have our bowl shape that we want. So let's keep working at that. Trying to make sure I don't get so caught up in my work that I neglect to cut any of the extra stems off so that those don't get in the way. And now I think I'm ready for another layer of glue. And I'm going to continue this process. gluing and sticking on maybe one more time and maybe work on doing a border this time with them. So I think that would look nice having an I chose these oak leaves, these white oak leaves, because they have this nice round wavy design to them and I think that will look really cool as a final bowl. And something cool to hold things in, in the classroom or at home. is going to have some holes in it most likely so got to keep that in mind with what I put in it but I'll also try to fill in some of those gaps too so I'm gonna put a leaf right here in the very middle and a few along my edge And uh, some of you might be thinking, well, how are we going to make sure that all of these pieces stay down and what we're going to do with that is once we have everything glued down, in a moment we're going to be getting a piece of plastic wrap to kind of go over this while the glue starts to set so let's put our glue on top of all of these leaves and then we'll apply our plastic wrap so that our bowl can start to set
think I need another one here. Maybe one here, so two more. Alright, so there we go. There's our there's our last leaf in place. I'm going to move move that one slightly. And then here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get a piece of plastic wrap. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay this down over top. And it might actually need to be more than one. So I might go in two directions, but what we're going to use that plastic wrap to do is to hold these leaves down against our balloon while it's drying, while that glue's setting. And that's going to help this these leaves to glue themselves together and glue into the shape of our balloon. So I hope that helps. I hope you enjoy this way of using glue and some nature to make something new. Happy making!